Hello everyone. So if you're out there boating, you're out in the water, you shut off your engine, then when you're ready to turn it back on and nothing happens, there's no click, there's essentially nothing. There's a good chance that your issue is the solenoid. Then there may not be anything wrong with the engine itself. Now I have a friend who has a much more expensive boat than me and one day he had to get towed back simply because this yellow wire had fallen off. Now when you turn the key, the this wire gets voltage which engages the solenoid. The solenoid, what it does is basically a, a relay. It connects the power from here, so this cable brings power from your battery to your engine. And this cable below here goes to your starter over there. So when you turn the key, it allows the current to pass from top to bottom, turning your starter. So the solenoid makes a little click, kind of like click, click, click. If you're hearing this sound, that means it is engaging. However, if you're not hearing the sound, that means nothing here is going on at all. Now, two things to check. So there's two wires here, the positive and the ground. For example, if this wire here falls off, your engine will not start because there will be no power sent to this top screw here, which will turn on the relay and send power to your starter. So in this case, all you really need to do to solve the problem is connect this to power for a second and as you hold it you'll hear your engine spin, spin so it'll spin doo -doo 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 -doo, and then you hold it for however long you need and your engine will start back up. This can also be the case with the bottom screw that is ground so if, if that's the ground you would connect one end to the connector here and the other to somewhere on your engine to ground it. This is just simple and it's important to understand this it's, it's very simple but if you're out there in the water kinda like my friend who had to get towed he literally got towed because this wire fell off. That's it. You could have used any wire, anything to just connect these two terminals which would engage the relay and send power to the starter. Now, if the relay does not work at all, so if you are connecting these and there's no click, there's no nothing, the other way you could do this is essentially you need to connect the bottom and top. However, you will need a thicker cable. As you can see, these wires are very thick as they carry a lot of current from your battery to the starter. If you just connect a small little wire like this, you will not get the voltage you need to get your motor started, so you need something something thicker. However, you can still, this helps you understand what's going on. So for example, you could theoretically unplug, unplug the bottom one and touch it to the top. So unscrew the bottom thick cable, touch it to the top, which will engage the starter. Once the motor starts up, you're good to go and you can connect the bottom back to the, to the bottom of the solenoid here because there'll be no energy sent to here. The engine will already have started and the starter will not need power again. But that's the case, so you can have either the solenoid breaking, or most likely what happens is one of these contacts gets bad, or simply falls off. And, and this wiring in boats, it's, it gets very rusty very easily, and this can just kind of a, make you have a bad day out in the water for literally one tiny cable. So um, yeah, that, that's basically it. If your motor doesn't start, you're sitting out there in the water, just see what's going on first. Is there any click? Do you hear any kind of sound? When you turn the key, does nothing happen at all? If nothing is happening whatsoever, it is probably that this is the solenoid is not getting any power or it's dead. But th that's it, just uh, troubleshoot it this way and a long tow back to shore could be fixed in 30 seconds. Make sure you always keep a wire or two on your boat just in case you need to jump something for whatever reason. That's it.